let's talk about MIDI in root. Uh, what we call MIDI in root, it's a MIDI to gate and CV interface uh, converter. What we do is we take all the voice messages um, that's not on, not off with pitch, and we send it, we route it to a track. This can be done uh, for one track, for two, three, up to eight tracks. Obviously, this is not the main purpose of the sequencer, it can be done, but um, if we, the thing is, when we are using a track and we are routing voice, voice MIDI message information to a track, we are not listening what we have in the sequence. So if we do this for the A tracks, uh, the sequencer will be doing nothing, but it can be done. Um, to access the configuration, we go to press function and press MIDI, we go to MIDI in, MIDI in root, and here we have the configuration. Um, by default, it's th there's nothing assigned, but here we have prepared a configuration for doing the demo. Uh, in this case, we are using Ableton Live. Uh, we have four MIDI tracks that are sending uh, MIDI information from channel 1 to 4. And in this case, we are using a USB to DIN 5 cable, one of those cheap cables. Um, and here, as you can see, we have channel from one MIDI channel from 1 to 4 assigned to Eloquencer track to D. It's important, sometimes it has happened to me, wow, this track is not working, this track is not working. Well, it can be mute or also it can be uh, assigned here. So, as I told you before, if we have this assignment, we are not listening what we have in the sequence. So, let's start with this. The demo is over, but well, I will leave Bach here for you if you are interested. If not, you can jump to the next video.